And now, the conclusion. Water? That's a good sign! Oh! Oh no, it's not what I thought it would be. I thought it was gonna be the submarine bay, and that we finally, finally found our way out of here to Omicron, but no! 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 Well, thank god there's a ladder. I'm not ready to, to, to go underwater just yet. Where does this even leave? That's a long ladder. I like my hand animations. I don't know why. Just most first person games don't even have arm animations. This can't be it. I'm sure I'm missing stuff. I mean, if I'm missing stuff, I'll have to come back anyway, so. Maybe I'm not. Maybe this. I lucked out and this is the correct way to go. Maybe it's Maybelline! Um... How I climb this? The answer is you don't! I have no clue why I'm doing all of this, by the way. I have no idea where I'm going, other than that we need to escape this place. Jeez, I really, really hope Catherine appreciates the stuff I'm doing here to save humanity. I can't help but feel like I'm missing something here. If I drop down there, would I die? I die before I wake. I pray that Satan, my body doesn't take. Okay, well, let's try. Yeah! And I can now cross over this, maybe? Hopefully? I don't know. Let's just hope that this is the correct way. Sure, let's flush stuff. Why are you- OH MY GOD DID YOU SEE THE SATAN?! Just flush me away from the satan please. He was standing there just watching me, he's like, yes I have found you, I know where you've been. At least I can still breathe. Ow. Hey, we're out here again. Maybe we can walk to Omicron. Oh, hey. Oh, that's the corpse of the last person that tried that, I guess. What happened? What did she do? Come on, we gotta get her out of there. Holy shit, hot blew up VO2 surplus. She sealed the tunnel. She really didn't want anchors following us to Omicron. Hurt. Her suit is leaking. We have to get her to Omicron. Shit, it's bad, real bad. No, fuck, no! Ooh. Well, I escaped to Omicron. <sighs> I mean, I know we're not exactly safe out here, but. I, it, it's better than being those dingy old pipes. Alright. Let's find out. What are these? They almost look like mines, except that wouldn't make sense in our context. Power failure. Story of my life. Well, let's follow the road. There is somehow a road on the bottom of the sea. How does that make sense? Maybe the machinery that installed all this stuff made it. I mean, that's how trails start out. And do you know, like, for the longest time, roads were dictated by the trails that uh, were put forward by them? Like, if there was a long-ass donkey trail, they'd just pave it and they'd make it a road. Because, I mean, that's the popular road, because... 
That's why there are animals trailing on them and stuff. So since it's such a popular road that people use often enough that the vegetation is dead around it and a path was made, that means that it's important enough to pave. And a lot of main streets and like even highways started out that way. Isn't that interesting? Or, well, rather roads that turned into highways later. Okay. Um. This is Omicron. Hope they save me a diving suit. Is that a? Yeah, that's a biohazard sign. Power failure. Okay, so we need to turn on the power somewhere. That looks like a place with power because it's like has lights on it and stuff. Shut up! Don't. <laughs> My logic is flawless. No, because it looks like the only structure that I can actually enter. And, I mean, it's the only one with a ladder, so... Let's try our luck. Maybe there's something down there, but, I mean, we'll take this one piece at a time. Don't rush me! I'm actually pretty proud that I have not been stuck so far this session. Being stuck by Satan's hiding in a room is different. It, it's offline, right? So, I mean, it's not gonna work. What about this? This is non-functioning. The pressure pump. Hmm. And I assume I can't, like, force this open anyway. Nope. Okay, so, the manual override. I'm a manual kind of guy. Flush, little children, don't you cry. Satan's gonna punch you until you die. Better be careful. Why? What did I what did I what did I do? Oh, open valves. And now I can do the pressure pump. Right? If it all explodes in my face, tell my mother I said hello. Okay! Now can we flush? Yeah! Go to engineering school, they said. Why would I when I just cracked that when I've never taken a class of engineering in my life? Take that, engineers. You should all be crying. No, don't, don't, don't cry, don't cry. Yeah, if only maintenance was that easy in real life, huh? Power shooting! Keep fiddling around until something turns yellow, then you can press it. Power failure, power failure. I found it this way! I didn't break anything! Can I data mine you, even though you're actual human? There's nothing. Getting anything. I can't read him like the others. He's special. He has special eyes. Kath. Kath. What? What? There you are. Where are we? We're right next to Omicron, a smaller building connected to the main site. Can't you tell? No, my view is pretty limited. There's some heavy restrictions on my system access. Did you find a power suit? Not yet. I'm trying to figure out how to get into Omicron, the big building. Oh, okay. Keep up the good work. That's it? You got nothing? Good luck. <laughs> I thought you were gonna help me somehow! Kath, how are you so okay with all this? With what? Being a talking box, for one thing. Not being human. It's not so bad. So, you're not bothered at all by not having a body? I'm getting there. You're making me feel really self-conscious. Come on, be serious. I never felt that comfortable being human in the first place. This isn't much worse. Not being able to move would freak me out. Glad you got the box and not me. Would make it a little easier to help out if I had a body, but you're doing a good job. Just figured being able to stretch a little would give you some ease. 
My physical constraints don't translate to my experience very well. I feel about as human as before, but as if suspended in air. Which is kind of interesting now that I think about it. So we need to get the power down to here. I honestly do not understand this puzzle so far. Kath, why do you think I was made? Why would this AI, the WoW, bring me here? I don't think we could ever know. I have my own beliefs, but nothing that can be verified. Tell me, why do you think the WoW brought me here? The WoW had a range of assignments, but they all sprung from one single idea. Preserve humanity. When the comet hit the Earth, killing everything, leaving a fraction of humanity left alive, the WoW started to compensate. It's restoring humanity. I think so, but I don't think we share its definition of human. Or life, for that matter. I don't know what I did, but I just did it. Oh, the terminal just lit up. Yeah! Anything on the radio? Whoever, do we have any painkillers left? This tinnitus is becoming crippling. Sorry, we only have heavy stuff left. Morphine level drugs. I'll take it. Feels like my head is about to explode. You can do. That's stuff for emergencies. Besides, Cameron thinks the ringing will settle when JR reaches 100%. Then tell him to hurry the fuck up. Should be a matter of hours. Just hang in there. You keep me posted. Yeah, well, um... I have this thing I need to take care of, so I'll talk to you later, okay? Sure thing, Herb. It must have overloaded his black box. Humans have black boxes? Here we do. Company policy. It records your vitals to help medical personnel treat you in case of accidents. That's how hmm. I can hear the dead. Exactly. Uh, huh. Right. Yeah, you should be able to data mine black boxes, just like the intercom at Theta. Sweet! So now we know how I Catherine, can... Are we alive? That's an impossible question to answer. We lack meaningful definitions. Just figure there must be a way to know. To know if this life is worth living. You assume you've changed so much, but have you really? I don't know. I don't feel so different. The world sure does. <laughs> I never realized how much the idea of myself depended on where I am. How do you mean? I miss Toronto. Not because my friends and family are there, but because I know where I fit in. In Toronto, I know who I am. That's an interesting observation. Okay, well, if there's if he's stopping pondering life for a second, I am going to end the session here because it's a good place. We've finished the puzzle, we, were, we lit up Omicron. Next time, we actually try to enter Omicron. This was a hard session. Escaping from the Satanists was really blood pumpingly horrible. So, until next time, you all take care now. Bye bye. Made of sand. You try to hold it in your hands, you try to understand it. But the ocean asks the questions, and it holds the answers too. It dissolves away the lies about the things you thought you knew.